can feel the heat from here. Oh my lord. Oh, he's too pure. Go in. Oh no! Welcome back to another Simi Casey video. Today, you saw the title and thumbnail. We are shrink wrapping golf balls with this little heat gun. Today, it's gonna be a 1v1, like four holes. I'm gonna see how this reacts, see how it reacts against the club. But if you're new, hit the subscribe button. If you're subscribe button, like always, oh, is never an option, it is mandatory. We're on the road to 150,000 subscribers. You guys have been killing the likes and the views. I also wanna try this on some golf clubs. The only way I'd have to do that is get a little bit of bigger shrink wrap. Let me know if you wanna see it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy, and let's see if we can't get 9,000 likes and I do it to the golf clubs. Yeah. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm gonna get to work. We're gonna show you some clips of that, get to the course and play a couple holes. He's also, this video is a shout out to CC Mega Productions. He literally got rid of this. He gave me this video. It's gonna be fun, a 1v1 versus Buddy. Bubby, we also have Carl Villa. I don't know if you guys know him, Carl Villa. He's like the number one- Junior golfer in the world. Number one junior golfer in the world. He is actually staying in my range room where I built the range. Absolute legend. But let's get to this, see how it works. I'm gonna shrink rack some, some socks. Let's look at the material we're, we're dealing with right now. We got this, this is what I think I'm gonna use for golf clubs. I gotta make it a little bigger. Then we have just a bunch of these little, little plastic-y things. So we're gonna wrap it in this. Where the heck we use? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut and this is gonna be the main thing we use. Shrink wrap it onto the golf balls because this is gonna be no dimple. Anyways, let's get to it, Matt. Holy shrink, Holy it's actually God. working. Oh, oh, oh don't roll away, man. All right, we have two balls done. <laughs> Just look at this. I mean, as long as, if you hit it straight on, you're all right. In the air, this thing is gonna do Dude. some weird stuff. It gives it extra bounce, no cap. Look at that. All right, we have switched to clear, so we have a mixture of balls. Look at that. Holy heat gun. We leave about an inch. <laughs> we might have messed that one up, but Harry. Just do it in your hands? Yeah, let's see. I'll, All right. I'll tell you. <laughs> Harry! Am I getting third degree burns? Yeah, but look at the ball. Look at it smoking. Yeah, my hand was on fire. <laughs> Anyways, we have done four shrink wrapped in plastic, three shrink wrapped in the heavy duty stuff, and we're gonna go out to the course and have a little challenge. All right, we have made it to the course. You already know, back nine at Twin Creeks, we got Bubby, we got Matt. How you doing? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> two drivers. No, it's a three wood and a driver. I kind of got this from Mexico. So we got- I like plastic. We got, okay, so plastic is the play. We got, this one's kind of messed up. I'll take that one. Then we got the other two that are kind of normal. And uh, yeah, we'll start off, it is a par, five i don't know where we're playing it from we're playing it from the whites so we can actually reach it just in case anything happens with the plastics but who wants to start us off shoot i'll start it off what is this crusty steve it's plastic i dude i want to see how it flies is it supposed to give you more yardage or no it depends on the dimples but we took away the dimples and we added plastic which is heavier it'll reduce the effect spin rate has on the ball because yeah. the dimples can't catch the air it'll be all right all right Matt starts off uh-oh Uh-oh. Here's the problem. Here, like, we have a little bit of an issue. That's gone. The plastic, so that's why I brought the blue one. We all can start out with this on the first the first shot, yeah. but then we gotta go to the plastic. I like the sound of it, though. Did it you did. hear that sound? It was like a little zap. Made a little zoop. All right, Bubby with the Maverick driver. Oh, my Lord. Holy height of greatness. <laughs> that thing went straight up. Should be good down there. But yeah, the it should be past all the stuff, so you should be able to find it pretty easily. Oh. Yeah. This, look at the, look yeah, the shrink wrap will be gone once you hit it. For sure. As you can see how thin it was, it's super thin. That's why I shrink wrapped with the big plastic, which is what I'm gonna do on the club. It makes a satisfying sound. It's kind of like our gold, it's like our gold. Remember that, Matt? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, before we get into that, we have some divers down here that are gonna go looking for the gold golf ball. Yeah, we're gonna get that thing back and we're gonna sell it for a quarter all right steve no pressure but we all hit it bad and he hits it honestly not bad no it's the, i can tell where the plastic messes it up okay i'm in i'm in the rough there's probably no way to hit this straight just because of the crustiness on it. we'll blame it on the crust we'll blame it on the crust i mean it is a little bit windy a little bit crust kind of like la a little crusty but <laughs> <laughs> nah i'm it's kidding literal. i'm kidding off the start what are you feeling off the start i must say the sound is quite satisfying yeah, no, I really enjoy the sound, but we couldn't tell what happened because it came off. Yeah. Uh, we'll blame those three poor shots on the crust. I, I'll we'll blame it on the crust. The crust. We'll blame it on the crust. But no, they, I, I see, I thought I had. 
head there. I was like, these things are gonna fly off. I did it once with the gold golf ball. I knew it was gonna happen, so I prepared myself. You absolutely stripe showed that, but unfortunately, you're gonna have to take your pick between these. <sighs> Freak, I'm gonna take the best one. Okay, I'll give Bubby the second best because he actually Thank can hit you. it. And I'm gonna take <laughs> you can work on that. Probably. I'm gonna work. I'm gonna work on this one. But this is really heavy duty. If we could take this little plastic off, it would actually fly better. But as you can see, literally no way you're hitting dimples on this one. That's 200 right there, Matt. Correct? The blue thing. Yeah. Okay. So you're just probably you're probably 180, 180, 180 out. This should be a probably. I could probably get a good eight iron there. But with the old backy poo, I think I'm gonna swing smooth. Oh, so you're 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 using Steven clubs. I'm using the Steven technology here. I like it. Oh my! Look at the flight on that. Baby draw. I didn't see it, but it was really good. This short. It looked. It went like this. I will say, it dove right when I hit it. Interesting. Once it hits the ground, Steve, it's gonna go nowhere. So. Okay. That's good to know. Are you long? No, I think I'm short. So I'm gonna have to hit a three wood from 230, which would be my perfect club. And here's where I have landed. As you can see, the only thing done with this ball is kind of got burnt, a little crispy. Probably. We got the we got the blue ball. One side's a little more gaping now, so I'm gonna gaping. leave you. I'm gonna leave the other side. The goal is to have it go straight. Three wood. I can't get it there usually, so this is gonna even be more interesting. Oh! Holy, God. sit okay, down. Look at that. That thing Ooh. dove. It was like an airplane. It took his <laughs> The right. noise, by the way. The sound is very satisfying. The left wing literally popped off and it just went <laughs> Crash, dive, boom. Bubby, where did you go? Well, as you can see, I missed the ball, number one, but it also did dive straight right. We found a Strixon, which was his ball. He's in this crust. Just set it Just set it on the top, because we're gonna get- I Set mean, it on the top? Just set it on the top so you can get a ball to it, because it's already go. hard to hit. You're a little over 150 out, 160. I'm gonna step on an eight on it. Well, the biker has yep. commandeered our fairway. Don't know how this is going to work. I don't either. It's in a tough lie, and also the ball is messed up. Wow, look at it dive. I hit it well. It just dove straight down. It just dove. Do you, it, wow. The, <laughs> the wedge shots are going to be interesting. Yeah, on the green as well, but that literally just dove into the ground. Honestly, not too bad. I'm about 100 out. I'm going to club up and hit a P wedge to get it there. I just need it on the green. I'm going to change this rule where you can set it up where it you can hit it straight. Oh, okay. You do that in every video. It's all right. All right, here we go. I'm guessing it's going to go straight right. Sure, by a mile. It takes off about 10, 15, 20 yards. <laughs> it takes off a lot, it yeah. It takes off so, many, so much yardage. I still can get up and down for a par. We all are right around the green, but it should be interesting. It should be. I have no clue what I'm gonna hit from like 60 yards. You want to switch up and do a scramble on the next hole? To see how low we can go? Yeah, no, just to get more pure of ball flight. Oh yeah, we can do that. So whoever wins this hole is the winner and then we scramble it. So you're saying like we could switch up the format on every hole. So yeah. it's 1v1v1, one one one. next to scramble, we could do an alt shot, we could do something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I, I want to do an alt shot with this thing and see how bad we can do. Dude, I feel like we can, I feel like we can break some records. I'm gonna play an eight iron. What do you think I have, like 65, 70? Yeah, yeah at most. 70? And I'm just gonna try and roll it up there. I like that. Putting it up in the air has not worked well for us. So. No, also the wind situation. Yeah. That's so smart. You did exactly what he said. I'm gonna roll right. Wow. <laughs> wow. I can't roll away. He has a birdie putt that's, though. That's, I'll take that. That's as good as I could do, I feel like. We got Bubby for birdie. Steven off the green. Gotta get up and down for a par. And Matt can get up and down for a, a par as well. I think since I'm close to the green, I can hit a little wedge in there. Yeah, you can get this up and down for a birdie. I have to get it up and down for a par. A little bit long. Do we have the putter? Yes, we do. Freak, that was good though. Was good. Next format we play is gonna be a scramble. Then we're gonna do alternate shot on that par three. And then I think we might finish it off with a, what's another format we can do? We could shoot a worse ball. I think with these balls, a worse ball scramble would be very entertaining. All right, final hole, we're gonna do a worse ball. goes forever it doesn't stop so we're gonna let him go for go first with his birdie putt i got a par putt matt has a birdie putt how are we coming out of this with birdie putt 
Wow, that line was good with what you had. Wow, I thought it, it rolls weird. I'm not gonna say this is tapping because of the ball. I'm gonna get behind you, already. You already know this is for his bird. Holy wrong break of destiny, but look at the speed. Perfect speed, not yeah, the right I watched break you here. hit it. Steve does not <laughs> does not have the luxury that we have. <laughs> Boy's talking about a roll. This thing just rolls left. This is for my bogey. You're not at the same time. Oh my goodness. There it is. Oh, why did that go back left? All right. Nice tap in. Triple. Triple. Okay, I lost this. I'm not going to lie, but these boys are fighting it out for the W. Matt for par, and then we got Bubby for par. Cash. Uh oh. That was a pretty solid putt. I like mean, Steve using green balls. Like, we know who's is who's. Bubby. To tie up Matt. All right, all right, two pars, one triple. Honestly, all right, we're ch changing it up. The next hole is uh, gonna be a scramble. These boys tied. We're changing it up to a scramble. See what happens. See if we can't make a birdie. All right, we are playing this hole from 309 yards. It is a bit of a dogleg right. I mean, not a dogleg right. You can literally just cut it right over there. But drivers all the way, boys. I'm excited to see how this thing reacts with the driver. Here we go, Bubby. About to smack one 562 yards. Oh yeah, that's oh, good. That's really good. Down. Where'd he go? That's gonna be a good spot though. I didn't see it. It dug into the ground. I, I couldn't think see. It went down. And it went right over that third hump. So it should be in the fairway. All right, Steve. Now with gonna, the driver. I'm gonna tee it up just a little lower than I usually do. See if I can't keep it under the wind. All right, that was actually smacked. We're in the fairway, but Bubby is still in a better place. All right. Ooh, he's, Ooh, he's the are you seeing that? He's he's twisting it towards himself. Maybe it does something. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe it makes it worse. I'm about to see. I'm about to see. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Hey. Got it further down there than me. Three decent shots. I'm in the fairway. Matt's in the fairway, and I think Bubby hit it the longest. So we're gonna take that just to get a little advantage. Matt's three wood, which I think is a strategy to keep it under the wind. I think so. You're that... looking like a turtle right now. Yeah, it's a hundred. Hundred from where we're at. I'm gonna club down and hit an eight iron. Who wants to go first? I'm gonna hit that eight iron bump and run thing again. All right, eight iron bump and run. I like that strategy. He played the bump and run, and it is on the green. Sit down. Holy that moly. that could be long. You <laughs> kept it under the wind. I almost missed that golf ball. <laughs> Full swing an eight iron right at the pin. I tried to, but my accuracy. I just feel like this wind is gonna—it's gonna either take left or right. No, you'll be all right. Oh wow, well, that, that is good. Money. I can sit. No, he needs oh, to go. That's money. Matt, you freaking beast. You look like a turtle right now. I, I am a turtle. This handle's gonna fly off my head. Yes, that's the turtle, Steve. <laughs> Anyways, we got a putt for bird boys. I can't believe it! Mine would have actually been a good shot if it was on the green, but Matt came, he saved the day. I find a way to play golf better with things that aren't actually golf balls. That is actually facts. This is all you, you can make your own birdie. If we all just would have hit it straight in the right line, it could have gone in the hole. I think it literally could have. If the hole was somewhere over there, right here, or where <laughs> you were, we would have made it already. That would have been three hole, hole outs from 100 yards. A little left. I had it going a little left. Ooh. Let's all let's all use the same ball so we can get the best score. I like that. Keep it consistent. Matt, mark it with the tee box. A good, good tee. Heck yeah, it is. All right, Steve. You know it kind of goes a little right, maybe. Yeah. Hit it. Get hit there. it with your leg. Get there. We have a tap in. Go. Oh, good roll. Tap in part. It kind of was consistent right there. He needs my speed. If he has my speed, that's a W. It's in the hole. Wow, I threw that hard. Jiminy, what a <laughs> chuck of destiny. No! Oh, no, it let me! 
I thought that had it. Yo. Oh my Bro. goodness. God, all right, we got out of here with the par. He hit the lip. What? And the pin. Honestly, I can't tell if it would have gone in if we didn't have that. You can try your best to tap this in for par. And just like that, barely, <laughs> but it like worked. That. Let's go. Hey, we are currently with this format, even par. Alternate shot next. You, you got the tee shot. You hit the best last shot. All right. I'll you take got the tee shot from the white tees. If I can get her on the green, ideal. If not, somebody's got to chip it in. So Matt's gonna be taking the tee shot. Bubby's gonna go. Uh, who's the best putter? Hey, but wow. buddy, Bubby. You want me to putt first? He'll go one, two, three. Yeah, one, two, three. So that's our format for the next hole. Let's get to it. 156 from the whites. Matt is going first. You know the strategy. It is a par three. Matt is gonna go ahead and slap one up there. Oh. Four iron? No, ooh. <laughs> no, because last hole your three would went like two hundred. Because we had a hundred down to three. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll hit. I'll hit this four iron. Hopefully, keep it underneath the wind. It's straight into the wind. All we gotta do is is hit. Get the good line. Get it on the green and make some putts. That was hit well. It's going to be right up there on the right side of the green. Not on the green, but right. Sorry, you can chip it on. Bob, if you want to climb. Yeah, I always, I always switch it up. I, I chip yeah, it. it yeah, All I right. chip it, you putt it. That's what the strategy is for there. Get it close to the hole and bubby tap in, hopefully. All right, Matt would have actually been pin high, but we were dealing with a chip. He's all right. He did good. Mr. Turtle Head also broken back of Destiny, but I'm still hitting the ball right. Every wedge. Here's the deal. I think you take 56. You okay. land it on the green a little short, let it kind of run. Just land it on the green. Okay. Yeah, and on the green we'll is key. Oh, he's too pure. Go in. Oh, no. Oh. Ooh. Harry, that's what we Harry. needed. Man. All right, we got Bubby for a three foot tap in. If it goes in, we're even far through two. That, that, but I, <laughs> Bubby, literally smack her in, hope for the best, watch the mic, man. Yeah, mic's still going. If it dies, we can still use the Excellent. camera audio, which is still not too bad. If you want to hold the flag so it doesn't sound like a rumpus rack. All right, Bubby. You're the man. My man! Not missing. Let's, Let's freaking go. go. <laughs> All right. Uh, going on to the final hole. We're doing worst ball. Got out with another par. These guys have made three pars in a row. I have made a triple and two pars, technically. Fab. Okay. It's Fab. Steven Fab. Shut up. We got to sit down there. We doing worst ball in this next one? Yes. Can you shut the heck Can up? Can you not mess it up, turtle head? <laughs> Me, turtle head? All right. Final hole, worst ball. It's going to be interesting. I'm excited for this worst ball. I've never done worst ball in with normal golf clubs before. Oh, so boy. I'm excited. This is, is going to be interesting. All right, final hole. Par four. Almost dead straight from the white tee boxes. I'm not quite sure of the yardages, but we're going to we're going to rip her with goo. The goal is everybody to be in the middle of the fairway. Does that happen? No. But honestly, worst case scenario, the worst ball is just the furthest away. You know, somewhere in the rough or something. Worst ball is really tough. Not everybody's probably gonna hit it the fairway with these shrink balls of destiny. Just don't go in the trees. The goal is to everybody be in the fairway, everybody would be on the green, so you're always choosing the worst ball, but it's like two feet away. But with three wood, I like this play. Wow, that's definitely not gonna be the worst one. Jeez. What I did there is I used Matt's strategy mm. for having a little bit of the ball making contact with the club. It's a good idea. I'm going with the same strat. All right. Yeah, it is. Okay, so, so far the strategy is working. We're all in the fairway. So, the worst shot is going to be in the fairway. Unless Matt. I get the crustiest ball. <laughs> <laughs> all right, he's going to hit that. Oh, yes. Everybody is in the fairway. <laughs> what is happening? I have never, ever, in my three 75 years, seen three people hit it dead straight in the fairway in worst ball. How many birdies do you guys make in worst ball? Zero. Zero. We've never made a birdie. Today is the day. We're making a bird. Here is one of the balls. We found bubbies. We found the worst ball so far, which is back at the 150 stake. Oh, it's right there. They're right next to each other. <laughs> All right. It, it, We're just blind. Dude, it, these balls are hard to see, but the worst ball is actually me, which is not bad because we're only 100 160 out let's see what we can do can we all hit the green you just ran it over I, potentially i didn't, can't see with my eyes i'm hitting four iron probably i think i'm gonna hit a six oh, we do have a little we bit of wind wind that you're right back. i think i'm gonna hit a six as well all right i like the six I feel iron. like because the four iron i can't hit it 
and sometimes you just have that feeling. Why do you look like you're gonna cry? <laughs> it's gonna be all right, Steve. All right, six iron is a good shot here. Uh, we do have a little bit of wind with us, so that will help. It's pretty much that simple. Bubby, going first. Uh oh, that's fine. That's fine. Sit right there. Oh, that went deep. Holy deep! Okay. It's on the left side, so right now, okay, the, that's not bad. The it's right not a terrible leaf. I guess you had the best ball. You probably could have done seven. True. Because the this ball and then that ball are the two in the worst shape. The first ball we did really well, so that could cause something. The goal is to not go on the right side. Left side is okay. Right side, no go. Stevie Poo. Good ball. Great looking shoddy poo it there. Be just a hair right of the green, but it was a good, good shot. All right, Matt. Final guy. Cannot. Why are we putting you the pressure on you? Hit the crusty nugget. Like this ball is just. <laughs> it's not in shape. Let's see what Matt can do. Okay, 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 okay. Sit right there. Greenery, I think. We have mine right. Bubby's just left of the car path, which is going to be the worst shot, yes. but it's not in the weeds. We were in That's play, big. which is the only thing that matters in worst ball, because once you go out of play, it just gets bad. We got Matt right there, Steven right there, and then we got Bubby right here, just left of the green the problem with worst ball you all have to make the final putt the goal is to everybody hit a good shot right here and then we deal we deal with it on the green i'm actually gonna go last in this situation because i don't like matt with the final bit of pressure we have a little dog cheering us on and bubby's gonna go ahead and lead us off gets it up just a hair long i didn't think it was gonna come out that hot matt the goal is to hit it onto the green Good okay, ball. that's a really good shot. It's a good shot. All right, Steve. Good luck with Greeny there. I find myself doing really well in positions that are really hard. When I play regular golf, I stink. Shrink wrap balls, I find a way to play well. Six. Sit down. It did. It spun. It, it kind of checked. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. Hopefully, you can escape out of here with a bogey. But worst comes to worst, we make a quad. <laughs> yeah, loving them odds. <laughs> It could be putted, but I don't know. Did you grab like a 56 or something? 52? 52? Yes, yeah. see, that's perfect. I think we could play the roll shot here. I'm gonna go first, get my shot out of the way. 52 in hand. Yep, it's gonna roll. Not Bad. that much, Steve, you schmuck. Bubby's going with the putt method, which could be the play. All he has to do is get in within mine. He did that. That's not going to be the worst ball because... Nice. Finally. <laughs> not the worst ball. All right, Matt. All you got to do is tip it within mine and we'll have to take Steve. He does that clean. So uh, now we all have to make my putt to get out of here with a bogey. I'll go first. I'll, I'll, I'll make mine and then put the pressure on you boys. All right, Steve. If right. you're not going to make it, leave it about a foot away, yeah? Because we all still have to make the last putt. Oh my, Ooh. almost cash. Two feet. I think oh, we all can make that, hopefully. That Should we go with the same strategy? I'll use one ball. This is the best ball to putt with, I think. Okay, fine. Is. We'll use that one from here on out. I'll put the club right as we mark it, right in front of there. Ah, I let those was two feet. That's not, that's not the play. Might go in. Harry! Ah, uh, that's a tap in. Good roll. All right, Bubby can make it, but it does not matter. Lip. Lippy. Anyways, we're gonna be taking mine. We all have to make this. Let's just get out of here with a, a double. Yes. Okay. Who wants to go next? I'll go. I'll go last. I'll oh go god. Last. It yeah. breaks. It breaks a little that way, Steve. Okay. Ah, that ball almost missed, but I made it barely. Cash that was center of the hole, Bubby. baby. All right, Bubs. Bub Nation. And Bubby. Bubblicious. To end it with a double. This would be clutch. Just Cash like all that. day, baby! Just like that. All right, <laughs> Let's boys. Finished plus two through four. With what we were dealing with, it was pretty tough, pretty interesting. If you want my golf clubs to be shrink-wrapped, let me know. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You can check out Bubby, YouTube, Instagram will be linked in the description. You can check out Matt Scharf. Uh, nothing will be linked in the description. You can check out me. <laughs> um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoy. What do you guys feel? Was it? Was it... Was it tough? I think it's enjoyable. I, obviously, you guys at home enjoy watching the videos with the altered clubs, altered balls, and all that. 
But playing with them is actually a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. You guys should go try it at home. Actually. I, I agree. I agree. And I, I always find myself playing better with non non golf stuff. So anything that we turn a golf ball into a tree or a, a piece of grass, I find myself hitting it way better. Doesn't make any sense, but I hope you guys enjoy. We will catch you in the next one. That's it. 150,000 subs. If we don't reach you by the end of this video, I, I meant to do a piece. There we go. <laughs> peace. Peace. I'll catch you in the next one.